Well, our trip out here to Hibernia started out very early this morning with a helicopter ride aboard a Super Puma chopper owned by Cougar Helicopters, a state-of-the-art chopper with a specialized autopilot system and a first-of-its-kind helicopter de-icing system. So needless to say, I was eager to get suited up and airborne for the TV trip of a lifetime. Hibernia, here we come! Our pilot this morning is Captain Rick Burt. He's been flying people between St. John's and Hibernia for over a year now. This is a very high-tech machine with lots of bells and whistles, and I imagine it must take a pretty high-tech guy with lots of training to fly one of these choppers. Uh, Captain Burt? Uh, exactly what does it take to fly a Super Puma like this one? Well, I guess you have your basic Transport Canada requirements, the uh, airline transport rating, but uh, Hibernia has got some pretty str uh, stringent, if not the, the highest uh, requirements in the world. So you're looking for at least uh, 3,000 hours for a pilot, you know, as far as hours go. Uh, this is one of the unique jobs you have actually have to have East Coast Canada experience to fly here. And that's why you find a lot of our guys are from here and that stuff. So it, uh, it takes a lot of local knowledge. It takes, uh, you usually won't find yourself in one of these seats until five to ten years into the business. So. Now tell me a little bit about the uh, people you fly back and forth between St. John's and Hibernia. How do they respond to these flights? Well, you know, understandably, it's a, it's a unique way to go to, to, go to work. And uh, these folks are, uh, have to go through a lot of unique training that opens their eyes. We, we're very frank with... Uh, any of the possibilities that may happen out here, and we have guidelines to, for safety survival. So uh, these folks are educated when it comes to survival and safety, and they demand the highest quality. And, and these folks are people we know. They're, they're everybody from friends to relatives. So uh, it's kind of an interesting group of people we have going off, off here. You know? So very educated people going off here as, as far as the safety and survival equipment on board this aircraft. We get a lot of questions. Well, Captain Bird, I think we're uh, getting close, so I'm going to leave and let you concentrate on our landing. There it is. My God, it looks incredible. This huge construction just standing here in the middle of the Atlantic. And I got to tell you, uh, Captain Bird and his co-pilot, Captain Don Roach, made a perfect landing here at the platform today. Tomorrow night, by the way, stay tuned because we'll have a tour of the Hibernia platform for you tomorrow. Before we go, I want to introduce Dave here. This is Dave Hoskins. He's from Arnold's Cove. It's a special day for him. It's his wedding anniversary, and he wants to say hi to his missus. Go ahead. Uh, happy anniversary, honey. You see, her name's Helen, right? Helen, yeah. They're all wishing Helen happy anniversary. See, he didn't forget you, Helen. He remembered.